I'm now going to cover a topic of the MVision HD300 satellite uh, and DTT combined a receiver along with a satellite dish which we're selling as a kit on the TV Trade website. If you go to the home page of the TV Trade website and simply click on DIY, it'll bring you into a subcategory here that's called uh, Satellite TV Kit. And you can scroll down and you will see uh, that we have um, the um, Envision box here and receiver. Okay, so this is the, the page on it. So basically, in the kit, you get the following equipment, which is the receiver itself, and you will get a satellite dish with a single LMD and a bracket uh, mounted onto the wall. So, fully covered within the, in the, the website is how to install a satellite dish. Um, so, you can just see the front. I'm just actually going to move this out of the way at this point so you can have a closer look at the satellite receiver. Move this down. And um, so I open the satellite box here. The first thing you'll see is the channel list when you open the box. The box has come fully pre-programmed. Uh, there's 76 standard definition channels and three HD channels that are available for free in satellite. Um, Lux HD is you know, not a particularly great channel, but BBC HD is very good and IPB HD, excellent for soccer and also of course it'll be covering the World Cup uh, this summer. So it's, it, it's, uh, from that alone, it's uh, very worthwhile having. Um, if I continue then, open up the box itself, the main thing, of course, is the receiver itself. Um, if you look at the back of the receiver, you'll see, in terms of inputs, we have an aerial in and we have a satellite in. In terms of outputs, we have an RF out, um, which allows the output of this box, along with the analogue, uh, if there's an analogue uh, signal coming in from an aerial, uh, to be looped off to additional televisions. We would also have um, a TV um, SCART output and a VCR SCART output. Uh, we would have a HDMI lead, a USB port uh, or an RS-2322 which can be used um, uh, to uh, program the box and also of course this um, USB port can also be used to connect an external hard drive to the box. Moving on then we have a manual, it comes with two manuals, one manual is for the box itself and the other manual covers the whole topic um, of PBR functionality on the box uh, which is, allows you to pause and record um, live television. You have a remote control. Um, which has all the pause, rewind, uh, channel changing options and ETG options. Uh, you have a, um, a, a lead and also a um, set of batteries, uh, treble A batteries this remote control uses. And also then we have a, um, a three pin plug. Uh, because it comes to standard with a two pin plug and simply make it easier for uh, British and Irish customers uh, that's provided as part of the kit. So um, I mean, that's um, basically it in terms of the channels. Uh, now, additional equipment that you could possibly buy along with this, um, the first thing I would suggest would be a satellite installation kit. So you can just see what we have here. Uh, this is sold as a separate product once again, and it's linked off of the main website. If you come down here to the associated products, you'll see there's a satellite installation kit. And you can simply click in here, we'll say, for this black kit. And it simply comes with 20 meters of cable, plugs and bolts to allow the satellite a bracket to be mounted on the wall, uh, connectors, uh, F-type um, um, uh, and joiners, uh, and also we'll say we have tie wraps and also um, black clips, okay? And uh, that's the first thing. Now, to date, all the equipment we've covered there covers purely and utterly the satellite um, um, part of um, um, the equation, but also, of course, as people be aware, the, H, um, um, the HD300 um, also has a, a DTT functionality where it can handle uh, inputs from the new digital terrestrial system. So if we see here, uh, I have the next thing, which is actually UHF um, aerial uh, kit, which once again is available on the website, and it's linked back off of um, our main page here. Um, so if we come down to the associated products again, we can come down to a UHF bracket. So you can see exactly the same, with detailed uh, installation instructions available with it. Uh, this will allow you to get the four Irish channels, and also a, a product that's linked to this would be similar to what we have for the satellite dish, would be an installation kit. I'll quickly show you here now. And that's just 50 meters of satellite cable, F connectors, coax connectors, tie wraps, and clips. And you know, if you buy all of these, four of these together, um, you'll have everything you'd need to fully install the system. But we sell them as separate items because often people will have a satellite dish already, or possibly um, they will have. Um, an area on the roof that would be compatible with the new digital system. Now the final thing I'll mention um, in, in relation to this is the um, is the 250 uh, gig um, hard drive that we sell. It's made by Transcend 
and um, it comes fully pre-formatted although you can reformat the disc itself and this actually we just use a USB cable to click directly into the back of the box and this will give us about 200 hours of recording time and you know it's very very convenient actually having it, it as an external hard drive because you can actually go down to um, uh, your computer, uh, load your favourite TV programs um, off the iPlayer or whatever onto the hard drive and then come along and plug it into the back of the, um, the M-Vision and it'll allow you to play back um, um, programs from the internet directly onto your television. So that's it from beginning to end. A full overview of all the equipment that comes in the kit and associated equipment for the M-Vision HD300 uh, combo receiver.